What's happening, Tokyo people? Soulman Top coming at you today. Had a little bit too much cheesecake and I got burn off some energy. So we're gonna have some showdown battles today. And our first challenger is going to be uh, Mighty Mammoth Swan, aka Baby Nick. And we've been having a few technical difficulties with this. Hopefully, this will work this time. So good luck. Have fun. Baby Nick. Okay. So he's got. Probably Mega Salamence, Latios, Azumarill, Mammoth Swine, the Magnet thing, and Celebi. Now this is just a more or less scrub team that I kind of threw together to play a bunch of goobers on Pojo, which is why the name of the team is Pojo. So now let's see what's going to happen. So we're going to start off with a Sashed uh, Infernape. You start off with Mammoth Swine, Hamlet Swine. So this thing is almost definitely Sashed as well. So do we go for the close combat, for the damage, do we U-turn out? I, uh, I really don't have anything that wants to come in and take. I mean... I go into that, but I don't have anything that I can hit it with that I'm not going to have to switch right back out with. Let's just go for the close combat. If he takes us down to our Sash, we can switch out whether or not he might even set up rocks on the first turn. I don't know. Let's just go for the CC. Let's see what's going to happen. So I hope you guys can see me. It's really bright outside today. The blinds are closed and everything. I don't have a light on my lamp that uh, shines in my face. Okay, we're just gonna pop each other's sashes here. That's fine. Now, is he gonna take this turn to set up the rocks, predicting my switch? Is he gonna ice shard and definitely take me out? Because this thing... Hmm. The only thing I don't really have a move for on his team is a Zoomeral. I mean, he comes in, takes a fire move, he comes in, takes a U turn, he comes in, takes a close combat. But does he know that? Can we get a set of rocks here? Uh, any move he goes for is going to take that. So let's just U turn. If he sets up stealth rocks, we'll know. And we can bring in the appropriate switch. Okay, so we're just going to U-turn out here. He's going to bring in a zoom roll. So he knows I have nothing for this. And at negative one, he could take another close combat. Now, do I want to bring in... Do I want to bring in Zapdos? And just bolt switch out on the sand? I mean, he could bring Mammoth Swine back in. I don't have rocks up. Oh, I should have set up rocks. Why didn't I set up rocks? So I can bring in Venusaur, get my Mega up. Oh, I really don't like half his team. So I set up the Mega Evolution. And then we're going to... He can't stay in. He can't. We're going to set up the sub. Thinking he's gonna switch out. He's probably gonna go into. My guess can be. Well, Magnus Zone wouldn't be a good switch. I don't know what he's gonna go into. He might go into Scizor. Try and set up on my face. And they're repairing the drive. Well, actually, they're completely repaving my uh, neighbor's driveway, which is driving my dog crazy. Gator, relax, brother. Relax. It, they're, they're doing the driveway. We were outside and saw it earlier. Okay, so what does he do? He brings in Scizor. Okay, so this... I got it. Are the Lati Megas banned? They have to. They have to. So let's just... He could sort up a Swords Dance here, which is really gonna suck. I mean, I'm gonna have to switch it. Let's just set up a Leech Seed. He's gonna Mega Evolve. We're faster. And there's the Sword Stance. So, we have nothing to hit him with. Let's go 
out with the Zapdos. What, what can he have to hit us with? A knockoff, maybe? I mean, he's probably got Roost. No, he's got it. No, I got the key player. What's he gonna do here? <sighs> Honestly, if he was smart, he would do this, but I mean, he'd work three different things. Uh, I'm, I have to outspeed him. If Mega Venusaur outsped him, I'm gonna outspeed him unless he goes for the bullet punch thing. So, he could bring Azumarill back out, but I could bolt switch right in its face. He could bring out the Latios, is probably his safest play, because if it's at all bulky and HP Ice, if I had it, which I don't, would do a number to it. So, what's he gonna do? I want a Toxic here. I really do. I should just play it safe and go for the Heat Wave. I should play it safe and go for the Heat Wave. We can start playing prediction games later. It goes into Azumar. Why? What if I had... I don't understand. So, I mean, he can hit us with a banded Aqua Jet, which isn't going to do half. And we're just going to bolt switch out here. Oh, I should have toxic. Gonna bring a mammoth swine. Oh, you son of a. Okay. Okay. So he's gonna get an ice shard off here. So now we're gonna go into playing the prediction games. Budget. Let's just go out into Scissor. Oh, I hate you so much. And that took us to exactly half. So I have to bullet punch here. I have to. Or... You... you ah, no. Go back. Turn. Okay. So now, ah. If he was smart, he would switch out here again. He would. But I mean, knowing that that did so much... Ah. I really want to fire off a knockoff here. Because I think he's gonna go out into Magnezone and I have a choice band and if he just U turn. Just U turn. <sighs> oh, freaking believable. Alright. Ugh. Fell right into that trap. That sucks. That sucks a lot. Alright, so now... How do you probably outspeed this? 120, oh yeah, holy crap does he outspeed us. So, I mean, we have to go for the Aqua Jet here. If he switches out now... Good game, I don't even care. Okay, stays in. Ugh. So that's one huge hurdle to getting Garchomp out here and wrecking his face out of the way. So here comes Celebi. This thing's definitely gonna outspeed us. So possible 328 speed. What? Doesn't Zapdos have at least 100 base speed? My leftover set, it's probably. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> probably a psychic. Ugh. This is so agitating. I hate celery. Alright, let's go on to Bob Marley. Why not? Why not? I mean, he's gotta go for a grass move. But he's gonna go for sidekick. No, okay, get right. Okay. Woo! Good. Now, he probably has psychic. But is it going to do enough to us? Uh -huh. Okay. Gonna bring Scissor back out, set up another sub. Perfectly fine. 
perfectly fine. I'm gonna go for the leech seed again. And the sword stance again. We got him down to about half. About half. Fudge it, we're going right back on this half dose. Exactly like we did before. And if he doesn't, I was gonna say, if he doesn't take this advantage to knock off, he's a moron. But he does. Now he could bullet punch us here. I still, I think we're gonna survive regardless. So let's just set up that roost. We lost our leftovers, which sucks. But, whatever. Cheesecake in the afternoon. Now I could, he could very, well, he's not gonna have a U-turn. Not on a sword stance set. If, man, I don't know. If he wants to stay in and do a move, he should roost. I'm not saying he's going to, but I really think he should switch out here. I gotta shake him my whole house. I don't know what the heck they're rolling up and down the street. Come on, baby Nick, I don't got all day. Get your head off the damage calc. I'm freaking bleeding. Well, at least I think it's 6 0. But I don't have a special attack left on my team. The hindsight of custom building your team would be something else. Now he has. Hmm. <laughs> he has one levitator. Or is he gonna bullet punch here and get as much damage as he can? <sighs> I have to go for the earthquake. I need the max damage. Zoomeral? Why? An Aqua Jet isn't going to take me out. Now with that damage... Good lord. At that range... Is an Iron Head going to be enough to finish him? He can't go into Magnezone at this point. Will an Iron Head kill in the event he goes out to Latios? Latios. Oh, Latios. I don't know. Am I? Expert belt. Mm. I think this is my straight attack and set. Budget. Iron Head. I mean, he better Aqua Jet. Say. Okay, there's the Aqua Nothing. Nothing. Oh, of course I'm going to take out at that range. Okay, now he knows I'm not Scarfed, and that could be a problem. But then he's going to come Latios. He's probably just going to drop a Draco. Are these beams? Latios carry ice beams? I really need to play OU more often. And this has been 15 minutes, and my Skype is blowing up, but I don't want to open Skype. Oh, there's my buddy Alakazam, 428. Alright, come on. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. Ah, dang, dang, look. What did you think I was going to do there? You think I was going to outrage on a steel type? When you had another steel type in the back and a zoom roll, the heck did you think I was gonna do? Oh god. Now. What's he gonna do? If he goes for Psy Shock, I could probably survive. 
my defense is significantly higher. It is higher, right? Like, maybe not significant, but it's high enough. Okay. Well, we got expert belt. That's not helping us in this situation. Stop thinking about the expert belt. We can go out into red leader here and just take whatever he's going to go for. Because, I mean, at this point, he's pretty much fodder. Mm. I don't want to do that, though. We are Assault Vest. So, wait, what's he gonna have to hit us with? Sing Get Poison Me? Budget, we're going into Jane Fonda. Jane Fonda ain't scared. Psy Shock. Oh, it did a lot more than I wanted to. Okay. Okay. 40, not 50, 55%. There's no way we're gonna take another one of those. That uh, was his best play. He wasn't going to Aqua Jet because he knew I'd have to switch. Now he's life form, so... Hmm. Let's just Aqua Jet, get as much damage on this as we can. Let him finish this up. Uh... I think that might be GG. Oh, our troubles be so good. Let's go to Red Leader here. Three fifty. Three forty six. Oh, he's gotta be max max speed. Now he has to know I'm not scarfed. Okay. And I'm out of priority on my team. Now can we survive? I highly doubt it. But if... Oh, I need him to be able to hit. Maybe? Maybe? Oh! The 3% survive! Oh, Mega Venusaur, you are. That was just stinking fantastic. Okay, we're going for the lead seed here. Okay, that's what I thought. I six. I want everything I can get. Okay, so... Um, Oh, we're expert belt, it doesn't matter. Bullet punch, he wants that max damage. I'll take the rough skin, go ahead. Okay, what's he gonna bring out? If he's smart, he go into Celebi. Damn it. Why do you have to be smart? Okay. Not by outrage here, that gives him a free shot. Uh, all right, GG. Okay, so I wasn't scarfed. Okay. Alright, so let's back out of here. Holy crap. Okay, let's... Do we want to use that team or do we want to use a different team? Which team is this? Megatranisaur. Oh, that team is so bad. So bad. What's on my Skarmored onset? No, that team is even worse. Okay, let's... Let's... Do you want to go into Megatranisaur? 
Fudge it, why not? Okay. <sighs> Regalophony. Fantastic. Okay, let's... Oh, and this is Sandwiches, aka Beth, one of my friends. No, good luck, have fun. Beth. Okay. So, what's he got going for him here? What's he gonna lead with? Relax, Gator. And we're going on 20 minutes. So this is probably gonna be the last battle in this video, or you know, we can break him up individually. You never know. So, uh, so many things on this team could lead. Azelf could be a lead. She beat me with an Azelf every time I play her. Fortress could be the lead. I don't think I have a way to get rid of Stealth Rocks on this team. So let's... What are we gonna do? It's a Crocodile? Oh, it's my Moxie Scarf Crook. Dang it. That's my Moxie Gyarados. Ugh. Let's go into Go Mantula. Why not? And we'll see. If he starts off with Fortress, he's gonna rapid spin everything I set up away. Anyways, so let's. Oh well. Okay, there you go, Mantula. Now I've gotta have that rough skin ability. Sticky bone budget. This thing's meant to be a one hit wonder, anyways. I don't have a focus sash on that thing. Life for God, oh, tough, you suck. Okay. So he's not scarfed. She's not scarfed. It's not scarfed. Chompy is not scarfed. We've established that. So in comes the crocodile. Does she have a levitator? The the fairy thing is a levitator. Oh no, I can't stop that. Why did I do that? Okay, so... Now is this thing going to be Rocky Helmet? That is what we need to know. I go for the knockoff. Am I... Am I, scar I am scarfed. If I go for the knockoff, and she goes into the evolution thing. That's bad. We're gonna have to switch out. We can, I mean, we can safely switch into Venusaur or Gengar. That's not a problem. Let's go for the knockoff. If she stays in, we'll see what I am she's packing. And hopefully, if she goes out in the fortress, we'll knock off the leftovers or whatever the heck it might have. Okay, that was a safe play. Then what did we knock off? The leftovers. Okay, so we need to... I can't even trick now. I'll run it. Does this thing have a status condition? No. Is she gonna set up rocks here? I don't think I have a hazard to move this. Why do I suck at building teams so bad? Yep, there's the Stealth Rocks. Now... She can bring in the Blastoise to suck up the Will-O-Wisp. She, well, she could have Heal Bell on freaking Fairy McGarry there. Um... What's it gonna do? Uh, a Fire Blast is gonna take this out for sure. Uh, she could try and over predict and go for that spin thing to get rid of. I really just want to click Will O Wisp. Click Will O Wisp, she's gonna switch. Nothing can suck up a Will O Wisp. Oh, dang it. But I want a Fire Blast. 
I mean, the only thing that's not going to hit good is Blastoise if it comes in. Or Garchomp. <sighs> Go for the Willow Wisp. If she rapid spins, that's good for her. She switches. Thank you, Blastoise. Why do you overthink it, Tup? And we get the burn. Bueno. Bueno. Okay. So now... What do you want to do? What do Blastoise carry? Mega Blastoise has that Wonder Launcher, whatever the heck it's called. The Hydro Cannon thing that makes Water Pulse super good. So we go into Venusaur, get our Mega off. Do I only make sub-seeding Mega Venusaurs? What could he bring? I mean, Fortress comes back out. Would she double switch here? Oh, Blastoise is a rapid spinner too! I forgot about that! Did we see leftovers at the end of that turn? We didn't! What if this is a salt vest? Oh no... That would not be good. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do, Tom? What are we gonna do? Now, she could go for the Rapid Spin, which we could block with Gengar. I really don't want to take a Scald to the face. <sighs> Do it. Do it. She got Rapid Spin. Oh, she double switches into... Oh, I said that! Damn it, damn it, damn it. But... She can't rapid spin while I'm out here. Ah, did I knock off this thing's item? Fudge, I did. I don't think I can trick if I knocked its item off. Freak. Does still, still resist Shadow? Or, yeah, Shadow Ghost? Now, she obviously thinks she can take a shot here. But if she goes for the rapid spin and over, she's probably gonna set up spikes. No, that's not good. I don't. I don't have a freaking defogger or rapid spinner. I'm so bad at this. So switch out here. Gonna get the focus blast off. Wham bam! Thank you, man. Hello. Do we risk hitting? Can we? Oh. Can we hit two? Because the. How much did the burn do? Is that gonna have to take him out? Her out? I really don't want to rapid spin getting off. She just switched out the first time. I'm trying to even get to see what kind of move she's packing. Do I play it safe and just go straight into Venusaur? Staying. I don't want a rapid spin going off. I don't. No rapid spins. Come on. Give me two hits. Alright. So now she has to think at this point that I'm scarfed or specs. Has to. So she, if the smart play is. She's at minus one speed. She's gonna come out. She's gonna fake out here to get the damage. I don't have a freaking Intimidator. How do you build a team without an Intimidator, Tuck? Moron! Okay. Let's stay in, take the fake out. Probably take us down to about half. Okay, about half. And at minus one speed, I want to say we're going to outspeed. What are the odds of hitting a third focus blast? Not really good. <sighs> I don't really have a safe switch in for this. Fudge it. Focus blast, let's go. 
should have speed. We're max. We're max speed because we're specs. Yes. Okay, come on. Come on, one time. One time, give me three. Come on, freeze company. Let's go. Come on. What do you have for me, low Pony? What do you have, low Pony? Haha. <laughs> I like that. Come on. She's probably trying to figure out what not she's gonna really ask you. She switches out! And I hit! Three in a row. Okay. Now at this point, it looks like I really have to switch. But you go for a psychic move. I gotta resist, and I got a neutrality. Here it is. Oh, she runs a really odd set. I still kinda need Heatran. To be able to wall out the Sylveon. Son, yes. Okay. Now knockoff is going to hit the rest of this her team really hard. I don't know that's going to be enough to two shot fortress at this point. I'm scarfed. What's she going to go to? Yes, I hear the other dog too. Relax. Relax. We're not going outside to see who's barking. Knock off. Fudge it. That's gonna hit whatever comes in. Okay, here comes the fortress. That's not half of the remaining hit points! I'm bringing Gengar back out. Thank you. That was close. Okay, now Spike Shadow Ball and the rest of the team. I don't like those odds. <sighs> Go for a fourth Focus Blast. If it hits, it's just gonna wail on whatever comes in. Now this is where Sylveon should come in. And eat up a Focus Blast, or eat up a Shadow Ball. Double switch. I'm not a big fan of double switches. Let's see if this one pulls off. Uh, what does she, what would she want to sack at that point? I mean, she would have had to been would she had to been scarf with that elf to be Jingar. Alright, come on, Beth, what are you thinking? Come on. Set up stealth rocks. She didn't switch out. Yes, she did. Want to be that Sylveon? Yes! Yes! That is what I wanted to see. And nothing at this point wants to come in and take a burn. Nothing. See what it's. She can have HP ground, she knows that I run a Heatran all the time. Fudge it, she's switching out, fudge it. She's going to, she's going to switch out. She's only seen one move so far, and she doesn't know that I'm not packing Flash in. Oh, that was such a good play. I don't get to make those very often, so I apologize for being excited. Okay, why can't I predict like that in the GBA when it's... You know, for my season. Okay, come on. You want to switch. You know you can't take Heatran one-on-one. -on -one. Stays in. Oh, is she going to wish past? Fuck. 
How would you do that? Okay, nothing on her team is burned. Oh, she's gonna wish pad. She could pass right now into Lopany. And she's slower than me. If she baton passes, this thing is gonna eat the Will O Wisp, and her Lopany is gonna be at full health and F me in the A. Oh, that's gonna suck. Don't baton pass. Don't baton pass. Hyper voice. What? Wait a minute. I don't have leftovers? What? I do have leftovers. Were any leftovers knocked off? Oh, no. Got him back. Just missed it. My bad. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did the wish not come down that turn? Oh, the wish comes down before the burn damage. That was awesome. Okay, now... She should switch here. She should. She's got heal bell. Oh, wasn't that just fancy? Okay, so... I shocked last time. What's she gonna want to do now? I still really need this thing. Psy shock before. Psy shock won't hit this. Does she have focus blast? Oh, I don't like the cards. The way she switched out makes me think she's scarfed. And she ran a scarf one of these against me before. So. Man. Fire blast it up. Whoo! That did a nice chunk. That did a nice chunk. So she's got Heal Bell, Wish, Hyper Voice, Protect. Is that what we're gonna go with? Fire Blast. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, she has Protect. I'm gonna scream like a little girl. She could just switch out here, but I don't know what she's gonna wanna switch out and then take a Fire Blast. And she has seen my full set at this point. Protect! I hate this set so bad. I really do. You know, the hyper voice there, that was fairly bold. I mean, granted, I'm guaranteed to miss this fire blast with everything that's hit. Oh, oh, is that gonna be enough? No. Yes! Yes! Thank you! God, can't stand Sylveon. Okay, now Garchomp comes out. Garchomp comes out because that scares me out, guaranteed. I do have a Levitator still, and I still have... Get, oh, maybe... No, 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 that doesn't come out. <sighs> what are we looking at here? What's she gonna bring out? She's gonna try and take me on. She can bring out Fortress and try and spin everything away. But I'm gonna outspeed in that Fire Blast and take it out guaranteed. If it hits. <sighs> if I get a DD up with Gyarados, it'll be a good game. Okay, out comes Megalopony. Got the lowered speed. How much health does this thing have left? Almost half. Man. <sighs> you play for the overpredict. I don't really have a safe switch. So let's play it safe, go for the... Well, it's not playing it safe, but I mean... 
Okay, there's the fake out. Okay. And the, oh, the wish finally passed. I didn't realize it was a wish up. Okay. How long would that was that wish waiting to come up? Whatever. I, I, I don't know. Okay. What you gonna think I'm just waiting to stay in the deal? Full health. Let's see. She go for the return? Nope, high jump. <gasps> oh no! We live the high jump kick. I'm so disappointed in that. We live the high jump kick and miss the freaking Willow Wisp. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. Oh, that was the right play. Oh. Yeah, I shouldn't complain. We hit all those fire blasts, all those focus blasts, and then miss a will o wisp. Okay. So now at this range, if high jump kick didn't take me out, I don't think a return will. Because that's resisted, and high jump kick is super effective. I can't believe that didn't one shot me. Ah, oh, Heatran, you're a beast! Okay, let's see what we're going to do. I mean, what? What? Now, is she doing this to be nice? Oh, she knows she needs full speed to beat the rest of my team. Oh, no. Do I fire blast here and risk a miss? Or do I let him spin everything away? Because I need, need that sticky web down. I really want to safely switch out and block this spin. I mean, go for, could go for gyro. She sh blech. She should go for gyro ball, predicting that. I can't go for a shadow ball because she still has freaking lopony fire blast. Don't overthink it. Right there to stay. Okay. Now, she's still got three huge offensive threats sitting back there, waiting to come out. My dog is still going to berserk. Okay. Okay. What are we going to do here? Guard Chomp comes out. Speed down. Thank you. Man, man. Thank you, man. Now, what items is Bad Boy going to be packing? It's choice, there's absolutely no way he can go for an effect. Wow. Let's reiterate that thought. He shouldn't go for an earthquake because I have a levitator and uh, Gyarados left. But, at negative one speed, I'm going to outrun that. Now, she gonna go for the safe plane earthquake? She gonna make the ballsy prediction? Budget will it wisp? We outsped! Oh my lord! One ninety. How is that even possible? I realize she's at a. Sticky web speed, but holy crap. <sighs> okay, we didn't see Life Orb. We didn't see Leftovers. So, she still potentially could be s uh, not scarfed, banded. What do you want to do here? Need sub seed. Just whittle this thing down. Now, is this my 
Funky Mega Venusaur. This is my specialty defense of Mega Venusaur. That's probably why Heatran took that so well. Oh yeah, that's why. Okay. Now, this thing could have Stone Edge. And man, it would suck if it did. Alright, let's... We're Scarfed here. Ah, I still can't go for an Earthquake. What do we want to go into? Let's go into Gengar. We're gonna outspeed. And I want to trick this thing. I will sack Gengar to get this... Not, not lock me. What did I get from... I'm gonna be faster now. <laughs> I definitely have to attack now. Sludge bomb it up. Sludge bomb it up. Wow, that was a really good trade. That means I'm gonna outspeed Lopini now. I don't know that I can take another fake out though. Okay, what's she gonna do? It's 4 3, this match is far from over. As I said, she has two huge, three huge offensive threats. My defensive mom is down, so we've seen a fake out and a high jump kick, which means she could still potentially have the ice punch, even though that crit didn't matter. Even though. Hmm. Now she knows I'm locked in. She. she the words. No, no. You should have went into guard trump. No one walked in the sludge bomb. You resist that. You should just wailed on my face. I'm scarfed. I don't think your fake out's gonna take me out. Oh, maybe it will. Oh well. So we're faster than you. Oh, oh, oh we can earthquake away. We jolly are out of it. Come on, baby. We jolly are out of it. Oh, no, it doesn't say. Okay. We got 311 speed. We got 405 speed in here at negative one. And I'm scarfed. Budget Earthquake. That's our strongest option. Well, I could superpower, but I don't want to be at negative one. For that guard trump to come in. And two earthquakes might take guard trump out unless it's like uber bulky. Which I don't know that it is. And even if it isn't, Gyarados could probably come in with it being at negative one speed and just clean up. God, those sticky webs came in so clutch. That's fantastic. For those of you who like to drink water, but are bored with the way the regular water tastes. Top drinks, black cherry, clearly American, obviously or if I'm clearly Canadian, water. Which is, uh, buy it at Walmart. Zero calories, no sugar. Um, zero calories, zero sodium, zero sugar, and zero caffeine. So an excellent drink to have after your cup of coffee in the morning because you get all rehydrated. artificial probably terrible for you though, but it's delicious. Oh yep, aspartame. Same stuff everybody complains about being in Mountain Dew. That's supposedly, you know, like fire repellent coating or something like that. I mean maybe I'll never catch on fire. Maybe it'll be the human torch one day and that's how he did it. You know? You never know. Delicious. Okay. Come on, Sam. What are you thinking about? You gotta fake out. She's probably thinking if she can switch out, switch back in. There's the guard chomp. Oh! That's gonna put it in two hit KO range, and that is going to give me the Moxie boost. I think that may be a GG. 
So I'm going to outspeed this, because we know it's not scarfed at this point. Because it did not speed something else, right? That was this battle, right? I don't know. So we're rolling with this. Oh yeah. Give me the Moxie boost. Alright. Pumping it up. So this is looking to be, unless she gets like an uber crit on this fake out. Which is entirely possible. We should have enough bulk to take it though. I think we should outspeed turn two. And, um, oh yeah, that, that wouldn't even, uh, crit killed us. If we outspeed, the game is locked up. And at minus one speed, I'm gonna say I think we should. Oh yeah. Alright, victory. GG, my friend. That was a great battle. Okay, so that's two battles, and that was about an hour. So we're going to do an outro here so we can split these up. All right, guys, this has been Old Man Tup, and thank you for watching Tup's Thunderdome. The Thunderdome. You know? Because that's what I'm going to name my showdown series. Tup's Thunderdome! Grabbing my dog crazy. Anyways, guys, it's the middle man tough, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Love, peace, and chicken grease.